Taylor Swift and Travis Kelce have entered the low-key era. Taylor Swift and Travis Kelce went to an Oscars after-party. There are no images of them attending the after-party, which was held at talent manager Guy Ossery's Los Angeles estate and was hosted by Gucci. But we know they went because an anonymous insider tipped off Entertainment Tonight with a seemingly benign reveal. They spent most of the night close together and by each other's sides, and looked happy and in love. They didn't have to go undercover. Despite the tight no photos policy during the fate, artist JR was on hand to photograph everyone from Matthew McConaughey to Selma Hayek. The couple could have party hopped. There is also the possibility that the pair partied and were photographed somewhere else in town. However, they just opted to remain out of the spotlight and they succeeded. This is a difficult task for Swift and Kels. From the moment they officially began their relationship in September 2023, NFL cameras seemed to be riveted on Swift in the stands at Kansas City Chiefs games. The paparazzi followed them on every date night in New York City. Then there were the TikToks so many TikToks of Kels at Swift's era's tour shows. How many individuals were able to catch his precise response when he first heard Swift? Swift's new lyrics to her song Karma. Karma is a guy on the Chiefs was, in retrospect, a true internet coup. It all culminated in Super Bowl 58, where more than 120 million people witnessed the pair embrace on the field after Kels and his teammates won the Vince Lombardi Trophy. It was the highest rated Super Bowl in history. For the most part, the spotlight was warm. Swift is a beloved musician, and Kels is a beloved player. Both have devoted fan groups. It felt like two of America's favorite people had come together and there were numbers to back it up. Lots of Americans like both Taylor Swift and Travis Kels and their new relationship, according to a YouGov poll from October 2023. When asked which of Swift's romantic relationships was the best match for her, the vast majority said Kels. He finished first with 22%, followed by Harry Styles with 8% and Joe Alwyn at 1%. However, mega fame always has a downside. There was caustic commentary. What's the big difference between the Golden Globes and the NFL? We have fewer camera shots of Taylor Swift at the Golden Globes, said host Joe Coy to an unimpressed audience. Then there were the outlandish conspiracy tales that circulated about the pair. Who is the most persistent? That their connection was staged by the government as part of a psychological campaign to pursue Wait Americans to vote for Joe Biden. They'd endorse him jointly at the Super Bowl, no such thing occurred. Perhaps this is why admirers of the pair are so relieved by their recent withdrawal from the spotlight. Kels expressed deep admiration for his girlfriend's handling of her almost unfathomable level of fame, saying, the scrutiny she gets, how much she has a magnifying glass on her every single day, paparazzi outside her house, outside every restaurant she goes to, after every flight she gets off, and she's just living, enjoying life. He told the Wall Street Journal, when she acts like that, I better not be acting strangely. If only for a time, during the post-football season come, she emerges from beneath the magnifying glass. Their discussion flowed well, ranging from music to sports and everything in between. They discovered a common love of adventure, a desire to help others, and a mutual admiration for one another's talents. As the night progressed, they became increasingly drawn to each other, unable to resist the magnetic attraction. Travis offered to walk Taylor to her car, and they swapped numbers under the starry night sky, promising to rem In the days that followed Taylor and Travis were constantly texting and phoning each other, discussing their hopes, dreams, and anxieties. Despite their hectic schedules, they made time to visit each other whenever possible, discovering Los Angeles's hidden jewels and bonding over their mutual love of music and sports. Their connection developed like a melody, with each note perfectly harmonizing with the others. Taylor sought comfort in Travis's hugs, and Travis found inspiration in Taylor's words. They tackled the difficulties of fame and money together confident that as long as they had each other, they could overcome any obstacle. So, amidst the glitz and glamour of Hollywood Taylor Swift and Travis Kels, discovered a love that transcended boundaries and won the hearts of fans all around the world. They had found not only a companion, but a kindred spirit with whom to enjoy the journey of life's magnificent symphony. In the bustling city of Nashville, where country music songs boomed through the streets, two worlds crossed in an unexpected harmony. 
Taylor Swift, the legendary singer-songwriter, and Travis Kelce, the Kansas City Chiefs star tight end, their paths initially crossed at a charity event when Taylor performed and Travis volunteered. Travis was charmed by Taylor's stunning vocals and compelling stage presence. As fate would have it, they were seated next to one another during the event's dinner reception. Conversation flowed easily between them, covering everything from their various occupations to their shared love of animals and philanthropy. Despite their disparate origins, they found a surprising amount of common ground. In the weeks that followed their encounters became more frequent, whether they stumbled into each other at industry events or planned outings together. They discovered Nashville's hidden gems, from quiet coffee shops to raucous hunky-tonks, and shared laughs and stories along the way. Despite their budding relationship Taylor and Travis were unwilling to accept their growing attraction. Taylor, who had previous experiences in the public glare, was concerned of the scrutiny that would undoubtedly precede any romantic relationship. Travis was also scared of the spotlight, having seen the media's unrelenting scrutiny firsthand. However, their undeniable chemistry could not be overlooked. Taylor and Travis were caught at a vulnerable moment one evening under the starlit sky on a secluded rooftop. With the city spread out beneath them and the calm strumming of a guitar in the background, they shared their anxieties and insecurities, exposing their hearts to each other. In that moment of real honesty, their bond became stronger, transcending the limits of fame and money. They found peace in each other's embraces, seeking sanctuary from the upheaval of their own worlds. Together, they accepted the uncertainties of their new romance, knowing that as long as they had each other, they could weather any storm. Their love story became the buzz of the town, with tabloids speculating on their every move, and fans hoping for glimpses of their blooming romance. Despite the unrelenting scrutiny Taylor and Travis stayed loyal in their love, drawing strength from each other's unwavering support. And thus, against all odds, two souls from different worlds discovered love in the heart of Nashville love, as timeless and eternal as the tunes that filled the air. In the bustling city of Nashville, where country music songs boomed through the streets two worlds crossed in unexpected harmony. Taylor Swift, the legendary singer-songwriter, and Travis Kelce, the Kansas City Chiefs star tight end, their paths first crossed at a charity event where Taylor was performing and Travis was providing support. Travis, enthralled by Taylor's lovely voice and compelling stage presence, was pulled to her like a moth to light. Meanwhile, Taylor, struck by Travis's charm and genuine generosity, couldn't help but feel a spark of interest. Thank you.